good day and welcome back to my youtube channel if you are new here i am lazan and if you are not new welcome back in today's video we are going to be discussing homeschooling and if you are one of those people who feels that children should not be homeschooled they belong in a traditional school because of social skills and all that vibe please click away from this video because i'm just going to be irritating you that this came out of the way let's move on so this is a smoothie bowl or what's supposed to be a smoothie that i made in a video i posted before this one so be sure to check that one out and then you can watch this one all just go check it out I'll, put it, I'll also link it in the description so another disclaimer i'm not saying that i am against traditional school so obviously i'm not against homeschooling i might change my mind and send this and send the child to school i might even put her in school and change my mind and take her out of the school so just hear me out okay so let's discuss homeschooling why do i love homeschooling the way i love it okay first of all i get inspired but anyway let's move let's let's roll with the idea this is just even me thinking about it. I'm going to give you guys like a few pointers as to why I would want to homeschool. Okay. Reason number one. Life is so short. Your child is so small only for so long. And then they're never going to be that small again. So why would I want to be sending my child away for how long is school? Five hours. Why would I over eight hours a get it? For most of the day, I'm sending the child away. Then when the child comes back, I must still do homework, which they got from school, and then they must go to school again. Only two days we get to spend together is the weekend. So that's a no from me. I would like to spend every every day, or maybe not every single day, but as much as that as much time as possible. With my kids, so feel that this one look with my child because it's my child, you know, and I love being with her. Yeah, that's the first reason life is short, it's unpredictable, we don't know what to expect. So, I just want to spend as much time with my child as possible. Re another reason, let me not number the reason, but it's my reason number two the world is evil, things are getting evil outside and the way the children is getting kidnapped and all the good things yeah blood from jesus or all mal in so antes ma i would prefer my child is vulnerable and not able to defend herself and all the good so i would much rather prefer that she stays with me while she's in that vulnerable stage and i know that sometimes it's not possible for all the mothers to do that and some others don't want to do it, and that's kudos to you. You do you, Pupu. This is just my reasoning as to why I would like to homeschool my child. As much each to his own. Ne? Anyway, yeah, I must just reinforce that. I must, in fact, I must edit in a bold warning trigger. <laughs> trigger warning in this video. <laughs> because. I know there's a lot of people that is strongly for homeschooling and a lot of people are strongly against homeschooling. Almost like the vaxxers and the anti-vaxxers are very, two very strong opinions and both of them make very good points as to why you should and why you shouldn't. Mar, get back to why I want to do what I want to do. Reason number three, I, I don't think there's a better person to teach your child than you i am i've got the biggest respect for all teachers and Huta, but i just think if there is someone who has my child's best interest at heart it would be me if there is a, if the if we busy sinking and the teacher only has three life jackets and there's 30 children she's gonna have to choose 
if it was a sinking, it's me and my child. I'm gonna give my life jacket to her. You understand? So, so I've got her best interest at heart more than anybody. Okay. Another reason why I would like to homeschool. I don't want my child's innocence to be squashed out quickly. You know, because and school has bullying and and yeah, you're gonna say I wanna shelter my child. Yeah, it's my child, I wanna shelter, I wanna protect her from the horrible world out there. I wanna protect her from all the bullying and until she's able to handle it. You know, everything everything handle it, to deal with it, overcome it, with what's the right word, but until she's able to stand up for herself. Okay. Is that all the reasons why? There might be a lot more. And the education system, even it with, but what? The stuff you learn in school, do we really use them in real life? Do we really use all of it? Yeah, some of it we do use, but most of the stuff you learn you use in your life to love your life you did not learn in school or it wasn't part of the curriculum the the teacher told you stories in between you know so yeah that is why i would like to homeschool then let's address the issues and another reason why i wanted to homeschool is because then She'll have more time to focus on the things she loves. We can develop all her interests without having to think that, no, it's 2 o'clock, soccer practice, 3 o'clock, hockey practice. You can only choose one of the two because it's going to clash. Nia, if you want to play, play hockey, rugby, soccer, Alice and Ian, we'll let you play all of it, you know? Ultimately, my whole idea of this whole life is too short for it to be chosen on your behalf how it should be lived. Okay? Okay. And and homeschooling is becoming more popular and common in South Africa, if you did not know. Okay, and and it's cheaper. Okay, so let's let's address some of the issues that could potentially come with homeschooling. The number one thing most of y'all keep mentioning if you hear the word homeschooling socialization the child will be socially awkward no she won't because i would take her to swimming classes ballet classes violent classes other type of classes but i possibly us where there's other children I can be the supervisor of and I can be the overseer of my own child. Okay? So that socialization Nope. Cut it out because and this church and this family and Okay? There. Social. There she's social. What's the other thing? Most of my one friend told me most of his valuable, most valuable lessons he learned was from school or from his teachers. Okay, kind of valuable lessons he learned. I can also teach, you know. And another thing that I want to add. Her school days will be shorter. I'm saying her because I currently only have one child. Her school days will be shorter. Whereas she has to be eight hours at school or five hours at school because there's multiple children in the class and one teacher has to give attention to multiple children the ratio is one is to 20 if one is to 30 or if i want to put her in a moral c school of that's a school and there's maybe one to 15 i don't know but at home it will be one to one and we're gonna make everything learning and so on this and then the other thing that i wanted to mention is that she can wake up okay it's not, not gonna be um lawless but she doesn't have to wake up at five so we can beat the traffic to get her at school by seven and then near near we're not doing that 
I would love for us to make breakfast together and she can learn about eggs and alaykhuta and milk and and then we should have a learning experience where does milk come from how is milk made where is cheese come from how is cheese made google and search alaykhuta you know everything learning is not just limited to a building or a facilitation of facilitation of Anyway, you can I work on an edit Anyway, so yeah, and if she decides, Nia, mommy, like it, I'm school, then we send her to school. If she doesn't like it, we send her to school. And if we do decide to send her to school and she doesn't like it, then she'll say, please homeschool me. We take her out and we homeschool, obviously, whatever will work best at the time for our family. I don't know, each family to his own. So anyway, I just wanted to, to address that and make this video from a colored perspective. I'm not putting race to it, but our people like to think, Nia, what is the Boer is good in Joseph Whitman is good in so and this that. Yeah, but no, for we all offend fans, fat of what have you. But that is most. That's the stuff kind of stuff I hear when I mention homeschooling. That's why I'm very selective who I speak with regarding homeschooling, because okay, so uh, if there's any further questions i am very passionate about this topic i have a lot of information regarding this topic so if there's maybe specific questions you guys would like me to answer please put them all in the the comment section ask all your questions i would love to answer them i would love to dive deeper into this topic and yeah let's 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 keep this conversation going because it needs to be half. This conversation needs to be half. We need to have it. It needs to be had. Okay? So, yeah. That's today's video. It was a mouthful, but thanks for... If you are still with me at this point in the video, you must leave a comment. <laughs> Thank you so much. Please do make sure you guys are subscribed. And you do hit the notification bell to make sure that you are notified every single time I upload a new video. Because you never know what's coming next. And give the video a like, a thumbs up if you did like it. I mean, if you are here now, might as well. And if there's any other content you would guys would like to see from me. You know what to do? Leave it in the comment section. And I will do it. If it's within my ability thank you guys see you guys through bye <laughs>